Hello, and welcome to another beginning Drupal tutorial. My name is Steve, and with Weaver, <laughs> wow, <laughs> my name is Steve with WeaverMultimedia.com, and today we're going to talk a little bit about views. Uh, just give you the basics on how to do maybe something with views, just to get your feet wet on it. It's going to be something really cool. We're going to make a slideshow that lists quotes on the left side here in a block, uh, but you can do a ton more with views. Awesome, one of the best um, modules for uh, Drupal. This best content management system out there. But before we get into that, I'm going to show you what I did. Uh, I created a new content type. You go here to content types, add content type, and it's pretty easy. Just click on that and just add your content type. It's pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> All right, and then um, what the content type I created was uh, a quote. So I can have like series of quotes on the side in a slideshow format. So what I did, when I click on that of the content type I created, it's just like creating a page. So no big whoop there. And under content, I'm going to show you what I have created with the quotes. Uh, as you can see, they're type quotes. And there's three different cool quotes. And one of them right here is just a John F. Kennedy quote. And there's two others. But you know we're going to have them show up as a slideshow on the side here. So that's going to be really cool. First thing we want to do, of course, is go to modules and uh, basically enable those views modules. So I'm just going to go down here to views and I'm just going to go here and turn them all on. I don't care really. Just get them all on there and save that configuration. Let's see what happens here. All right, looks like it went through. So we're going to go to site building and views is now showing under here under your site building. So we're going to go to views. This can be kind of um, daunting first time, but uh, you'll get it. You'll, you'll get the hang of it. All right, what we want to do is add a view. As you can see, there's already views, you know, on here already that you can utilize. But uh, we're, we want to create one that's kind of our own. So I'm going to hit Add here up at the top, and the view name is going to be Quotes. Just keep it simple. Uh, description description of it. Uh, slideshow of quotes. And that's it. We're going to keep it as a node. That's all you really have to know. You'll probably use that the most. And just click Next. All right, here's the daunting task. We have to actually create this node, or this uh, view. I'm sorry. <laughs> so first of all, we'll just do something basic here at the defaults. Uh, we're going to rename that to Quotes. OK, so I'll do that. Update that one. And the style we want. Um, slideshow basically <laughs> so we're just going to hit that as a slideshow and uh, there's lots of different um, options for a slideshow you can do your speed timer delay um, set your height of the slide um, make it random order you could pause it blah 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 you can add controls there's a page there's an image counter there's effects actually that you like you can do curtains just like you're when you're video editing there's different effects for your slideshow which is really cool i mean this is just an awesome module but anyway i'm just going to keep everything basically uh as they are in the defaults and update that okay so now we have slideshow and under row style we're going to make that something different than fields we're going to make it a node so that's all you got to do is hit that node. Uh, do we want to display links? No. We're going to have a full node? Yes. Okay, looks good. We're going to hit update. Okay, so that's a node. And we want to go down here to items to display. I only have three quotes. Um, say if you wanted, if you had, I don't know, 20 quotes you want to display, you can do that. Uh, if you only had three, you can put three. But I'm just going to leave it here at 10. That's fine because we have only three quotes to display. Next thing we want to do is we kind of want to filter out um, some of this stuff. As you can see, there's already a, in the pre live preview, there's already a, a page showing. Uh, so we want to kind of filter out what we want inside of there. So here's what we do. We go to filters and hit add and that little plus sign. And we're going to go to node under these groups here. And what we want is a node type because we want just the... Um, quotes. So we're going to hit add on node type and it's going to be one of the quotes. And we'll hit update. And there we go. As you can see the live preview um, updated that for us and now we can see that we are on the right track. We are getting quotes. And we want basically published quotes too. So you got to make sure in your filters you, you want to go to uh, node under groups and go to the one that says node published. 
just to make sure you're doing just the published ones and not your unpublished ones. And you just hit yes on that. And then hit update. Okay, should be no change down there in the live preview. All right, so we got quotes, and it looks like we're doing a good job. Slideshow node of here's the quotes, but we want an actual slideshow in a block on the side. So how are we going to do that? We're going to add a display. So this is a, you can add a page display, so it's like a whole page, or you can add a feed or a block. So we want to add a block. So we're going to hit block, add display. And all those defaults should come down here to our settings, since that's all I basically want to do. You can create you know, multiple views of the same type, like a page and a block, to do different kinds of things. But this is just what we're going to do today. So I'm just going to add that block. And as you can see, everything is basically the same as the top one. So I'm going to hit Save. All right. So it says, uh, Views, Quotes, is blah, 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 blah. So what this does is it's going to create a block in our Blocks page. As you can see, we go down here to Blocks, hit Preview, and it should show our quote. Make sure I, hit, I just want to make sure I hit Save again on that, uh, just to make sure that I have saved this view before we go on to our blocks. All right, so that should be good. Really simple. And now we go to Site Building Blocks to find out if our block is actually transferred down here. Let's see, it should be called Quotes or something like that. And here it is, Quotes Block. We'll put that on our sidebar first up here. And then, since it's, uh, oh, it's up here at the top, that's good. We're going to hit Save, Blocks. See what happens. And it probably put it down to the bottom. But that's okay. Let's see what happens. And it is. It's doing our little uh, slideshow. I'm actually going to go to the front page to see that in a better view of our view. Let's see. There's Jen F. Kennedy quote. Now there's Emo Phillips. <laughs> Computer buns beat me at chess. It was a uh, blah, 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 blah. So as you can see, really easy to use views, but you kind of got to know what you're doing first. So if you have a, a list of content, you want to put them into something like a slideshow like we did today. Kind of easy to do. You got to know what you're doing. So uh, if you have any questions, you know, comment me, and I'll try to answer your questions here on my YouTube channel. But, uh, yeah, that's basically getting into views a little bit. It's a really powerful powerful um, module here for the best content management system out there, Drupal. My name is Steve for WeaverMultimedia.com. Thank you very much for watching this video.